Uh, Linda and I met at work. We used to work together in South San Francisco. For her, I thought she was great. Because she worked at Express, so my way in was I need a, her to hook me up on deals on clothes. Uh, so, you know, I'll give was that, so I'll that give wasn't a, true at all? Oh no, it's still true. I still <laughs> wanted the deals on clothes. <laughs> Come on, it's a twenty percent discount, <laughs> right? So I still okay. needed that uh, discount, and she did. She hooked me up with clothes, tried to uh, improve my fashion, which I had none of, and still don't. <laughs> no, she was just very easy to talk to. He talked uh, for hours on the phone when I was up north. I know she'd be at one of you guys' house. Yeah. Who's in the back? Who are you talking to, Linda? <laughs> yeah, we did. <laughs> yeah, they did. <laughs> I actually don't remember. Oh, I think we're at work. And I said, hey, you want to go out to dinner and a movie? <laughs> <laughs> she said yes. <laughs> uh, I think we went to Fuddruckers, which is pretty casual. Yeah. Went to Fuddruckers and a movie, and actually I started not feeling good in the first movie, and the movie we wanted to see, so we left early. And then we just kind of hung out, drove around, and we went to Target. You know, what she likes to do <laughs> shopping. <laughs> Yeah, so like for two years we hid this, hid our uh, romance from our coworkers. What's that called? Oh, that's she not a That's, that's <laughs> what we are! <laughs> I mean, we kept it such a secret, we even drove to work separately, even though we lived together. <laughs> drove across the bridge every day separately. <laughs> the, hit the relationship from all our coworkers for like two years. Even after I quit, still no one knew. And one day we're out at Zachary's Pizza in Emeryville, and one of our coworkers saw me. He only saw me in my car. Because Linda was hiding on the floor of the front seat. And of course, the coworker walks up to the passenger side, looks in, and little ass Linda is sitting curled up underneath the dash. Are you hiding from me? <laughs> no, no, she's looking for something. <laughs> Oh, it's so embarrassing. So ridiculous, that girl. Uh, who first said I love you? I actually think I did. I don't recall the scene, so I'm not gonna go into that. It was probably four to six months, somewhere in there into the relationship that I said I'll ever. I don't remember how she responded. <laughs> it probably wasn't good. good. <laughs> I don't remember where it was. But we don't even remember our own anniversaries. <laughs> like when we're dating every year, like a month after, we think, we don't even know the exact date. But we just came like a month later. Oh, hey, happy anniversary. Oh. <laughs> It was never a big deal, and we never put an I emphasis put on it. Year. <laughs> All right, my favorite food is steamed crab. Linda knows I love steamed crab. Every time we, every time it's in season, I have to have it, and she never lets me. <laughs> her favorite food that she always wants her mom to make is um, like steamed tomatoes and beef. Or her other favorite is the blue crab and egg, which she just had for dinner last hey. night. Yeah. She actually makes a really good synagogue. So that's my favorite food that she makes. And since I rarely cook for her, I think the only thing I ever cook is steak. <laughs> but she did like it when I made it. That one time? <laughs> that one time. No, twice! <laughs>
She doesn't even try to hide it. I mean, guys, send it to work or something. Doesn't she send it to your work? <laughs> now she does. She don't even care. She just sends it to my work. <laughs> On my credit card. <laughs> Probably her favorite thing to do is go shopping together. <laughs> if she knows I hate it, it still makes me go. <laughs> uh, funnest things we've done together though, is like going out to Half Moon Bay or uh, Monterey. Spent a lot of good weekends out there just hanging out. Um, probably me because I'm usually at fault. <laughs> she calls me Chevin. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know, I'll just call her Sweetie. <laughs> oh, I think two. We're gonna have two kids, probably. And I know she wants a girl first, but I want a boy first. Because, <laughs> uh, one of the last Manny Cal, so I need to have a boy to continue the name. But she wants a girl first. My favorite thing about Linda is she's always taking care of me. She uh, she has my back through everything. She always makes sure I got dinner when I get home from work. Wherever she is, she can be out with the girls, but she always makes sure she brings me home something or makes sure there's something at home for me to eat. Oh, hey, that's it. It's Linda, thank you very much for always having my back and being there for me, especially during this time. Because uh, last year has been real difficult, and you've been there with me, supporting me, doing everything. So I really appreciate that. I couldn't have done it without you. So Linda, I'll always do my best to take care of you and support you as much as you support me. And uh, I hope I. Uh, Never disappoint you. And, uh, you've always been there through the tough times. And, uh, I hope you never have to go through the tough times, but if you do, I will be there and do my best to be your support. I love you and uh, I always will. With this Mary, I only asked Mary to go. I think it was a, it was a. And the next thing I know, it's a van full going to Shane Company. <laughs> well, was it, did she put down specific orders that you have to bring Mary when you're ring shopping? Well, she always oh, yeah. All right. Bring Mary or Jesse. <laughs> so well, how, we many people, how many people went with you? Who Eight, went with you? A whole van. Seven. Seven, seven, seven of us. <laughs> van. Enough to fit a van. <laughs> like a whole village. Yeah, even Hunter went. <laughs> even Hunter went. <laughs> Yeah, you did. Just the continued fun and uh, growing old together. <laughs> no, honestly, I can't imagine uh, doing things without her. She's always with me, and uh, I always want her with me. Everything we do, everything together. Linda, 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 I love you, Linda. Okay, that's it. No. <laughs> but what? Sorry. How did you guys meet? And right. first impressions on each other. I met Linda at work. <laughs> Let's cut. Start right over. Don't play with your phone. Take it away from you. Steam crab. Linda knows I love steam crab every time we, every time it's in season, I have to have it. And she never lets me. <laughs> and I think her favorite food is Wait, because why? What? 
You say she never lets me cuz, and then you stop. That's too bad for you. Hello, cholesterol. Yeah. <laughs> hey, edit that shit out. <laughs> You will say it, geez. Everybody knows. Everybody knows. So? So? The people you date don't yeah. know. I'm not. Can we do another question first? Okay. I don't know. What's Linda's annoying habit? Throwing sandals? <laughs> Kicking me out to the street to sleep? <laughs> Always that's, tell me, fun guy. You fun guy. No, that's like, that's the next question. What's your favorite thing to do together? <laughs> fun guy. <laughs> Think of him. <laughs> Who the hell is this dude? <laughs> Who's this? Hams up low. <laughs> Who's this low bang? <laughs> Who's this OG? Where you come from? Where did find him on the street? The fun guy. He might be a little too tall for our Linda. He's <laughs> like twice her height. <laughs> um, I think you guys have a special relationship, uh, Wilson and Kevin. No. Um. <laughs> Nipples dry. I need some clothes. <laughs> uh, how's that gonna? Is that gonna change after marriage at all? Or no, no. It's on behind closed doors. <laughs> what what's he's gonna touch his nipples? Hey, he's gonna need some more lotion. <laughs> okay. Do you guys have any well wishes you wanna give to the lovely couple? We love to, you know. But sometimes, you know, this old dude right here. You know, <laughs> we need to talk some sense into his head. But Aaron overall is good. We love the two. Oh yeah, what does what does Linda's grandpa want to say to her future groom? <laughs> Can't believe the grandpa. The government. Uh... <laughs> Oh um, well, I wish you guys the best, man. It's been it's been great knowing you. 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 Jeez, it's not the end. All the drinking nights. Yeah. All the drinking nights. Cigars. Ah, all those painful liver days. <laughs> Wilson, uh, Just you. Just want to say, wish you guys the best, and I'm really happy that you guys found each other. It wouldn't be the same without you guys. Yep. I think you're pretty happy, uh... Sorry, I shouldn't have cut you off. <laughs> Can you say that again? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I thought you were done, my bad. He was still speaking. Can, can you say that again? <laughs> Mom is done. Just done. Now you gotta edit it. Just, I can't. <laughs> you edit yourself out. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. work on it. Just say it one more time. Just hope our friendship go longer and longer, you know, make sure this family grows. We well, wish you guys the best, okay? Wish you guys the best. Hope yeah. you guys don't, you know, after you guys get married, don't forget about us, you know? I'll We're crashing your honeymoon! Yeah, that's right. <laughs> All these fools are going on my honeymoon. <laughs> our honeymoon. Yep. Don't be going out to dinner and not inviting me like a yeast, damn it. It's a yeast <laughs> thing. It's a yeast thing. <laughs> not a manuka thing, okay? <laughs> Um, oh, and, and Linda, don't throw too many sandals, man. <laughs> this shit hurts. It does. Emotionally, too, okay? God, you know, I'm tired of me turning Kevin, Kevin, Kevin I can't afford that many sandals, man. Stop. Stop making me sleep in the street. <laughs> I can't take it in that many nights, man. <laughs> <laughs>